warehouse sale, and we're here with... Laura. All right. <laughs> Laura, welcome to the sale, and tell us why you are here and why you're selling the things that you are selling. Uh, I have a lot of shit, okay. and uh, Jason motivated me to get rid of my shit, so come take my shit. All right, cool. I, know, I see a lot of stuff for that. We actually literally grew up in a second committee. Sinelli Frames, Sinelli Chrome, Deluxe, Dos Noventa Kids. It's like, why, why, why are you partnering with these things? You know, I just got a lot of shit, and right now I'm all about quality, not quantity, you know? I hear that. <laughs> all right, all right, cool. I mean, there's quality here, too. And but, um, you know. t tell us some of the parts that you have here. Oh, damn. Um, well, I have a really nice carbon Sinelli frame. Uh, okay. Road, 54 medium. I got some bags. I got some hats. I got stems. I got a little bit of everything. Bars. Oh, cool. Yeah. Boss with grips, too, ready to go. Yeah, right, ready to go. Some straps, what you need, pedals. I mean, there's probably a little bit of everything here. Are, are, are those the Gino 75s? Yup, yup, yup. Tell um, me. How much you want for those? I don't know. I, don't, I haven't even priced anything yet. I got to get away tonight. Well, don't ask me because I give you $30 for them shit. <laughs> right, let me take a look. Let me take a look. Hey, it's Terry B. Tell me how did you come to be part of this, and how do you know Jason? Well, I used to have a studio downstairs on the second floor, okay. and then... Uh, I needed to move out of that business situation, and then I talked to Jason, and I was like, I don't want to move out of the building. And so I came up here, and it's actually a really good fit, because what I do is make you know, cycling content for YouTube, uh, and he has a beautiful space to uh, have a backdrop for some of that stuff, so it worked out great. Okay, he's cool. here sometimes, and I'm here, and sometimes we'll just be rapping about shit while I'm editing, or he's like doing orders and stuff, so it, it's very natural, you know? Okay. Yeah. And I've been part of the community for a really long time, and I've seen you become a prominent member of the community in such a short time, and which is really dope. And can you, um, would you like to share with us, like, what do you think was part of your success in that? What do you think Terry did to make his name known in the in the Fix Your Second Committee here in New York City? Whoa. Well, thank you. I mean, that's that feels, you know, that, it has been a short time, I guess. Yeah, uh, I mean, no, dude, I sit at home and watch you. You know, I, I feed my dogs and I watch you. So, <laughs> you know, we all do. I think I've been uh, just, I think what got me to get noticed is just filming with some of the more natural people on, on their bikes here in New York. And then that kind of helped. Uh, like, who, who filmed this person? They're like, oh, this guy did, you know? And I've always been riding bikes and always been filming. So, I'm new in New York. I've only been here like going on four years. So okay. I've been doing this stuff for a long time. It's just I haven't pushed, been putting this much energy into making cycling videos until I moved to New York. And now it's like, it's been like 100%, 110%, you know? Okay. Uh, where did you come from? And why did you, why did you put in the energy that you have put into the New York City cycling scene? Oh, that's an interesting one. Uh, I moved out here for, for work, uh, job opportunities. Uh, Where are you from again? Oh, yeah. I'm from California, from the Bay Area. I okay. moved here from San Francisco. Okay. Uh, so I know a lot of the San Francisco, uh, I'll just call them cyclists because I don't want to, uh, you know. You know that's cool. That's, that's, what we call, that's what we call them here, you know. Yeah, well, yeah, all bikes. All yeah. bikes. We like to call them niggas that ride bikes. <laughs> <laughs> Every bike. Uh, and then I, I came out here, and then um, at the same time, I ran into a situation where I needed to separate myself from the business, and I was in a transition period where I needed to stay, I had to stay in the business for a little bit, so okay. while that was happening, I had extra time to start working on this YouTube stuff, okay. and it kind of just, it was a natural uh, progression. Nah, man, you definitely do your thing, because one thing's for sure is, you definitely showed people something that either they wanted to see or they didn't know that they wanted to see. Because me, myself, as a cyclist, like, what you've done is dope for the simple fact that every cyclist wants to get that angle film from behind of them just killing it. And you did exactly just that. And it's, it's dope. It's dope. It's really dope. And I want to say thank you for that. Because till this day, like, 2020... People are still giving that yo your videos the same energy that they given before, and that's a really good thing because it just shows that we're not tired or we're not bored of you yet, and it's just like we can't wait to see what you got coming next. Uh, got a lot more coming. Uh, I've been vlogging on my bike, embarrassingly. <laughs> <laughs> While we young, Terry. While we young. <laughs> Gotta do it, man. You know. I, uh, I'm also, you know, I'm trying to change up the the content a little bit and not only 
show that kind of riding. I've been doing some gravel and some like trails, and then we do a Tuesday night ride. I'd love for you to come out. Okay. Uh, at 5 p.m. here at Affinity, okay. and we go and do these. Uh, they're like trails at night. You need night lights, like trail lights, really okay. bright ones, in a helmet. Okay. If we're gonna promote the helmet thing, but you you know try to bring a helmet. Okay. Uh, and it's it's try. A good time. It's a good time. Okay. 5 p.m. here is better because we have a beer. Some people smoke what they need to smoke, and then we go out there, right mind, and then we go have a good time, and we stop midway and have another beer maybe, and then we continue riding. It's a it's a good time. And what I love about that is, like, you know, it builds a great sense of community. You know what I'm saying? And that's what we need now, especially, like, the more, like, like, I feel like we're at a point now where especially, like, the young generation is really watching us more than before. And the more accepting that we are towards them, the more than that will come and ride with us. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? For sure. And that's why, like, you know, like I said, I watch your videos. And I look at the comments, you know, I'll be talking my shit too. And, you know, I took my shit, you know what I'm saying? But at the same time, I look, I watch, and I read. And it's like, yo, we just all want to be part of the same thing. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? We're so, all doing the same thing. We're on a bike riding around, have, and we do it because we like it. We love it. So why not just do it together when we can, right? Why we can. Thank you, bro. Appreciate it. Talking to you, man. Thank yeah, you. Thank you. All right. My check. My check, one, two, three. <laughs> I am here with the gnarliest motherfucker. Please tell us, how did you come about getting that name? I already do crazy shit. Gnarly shit? Or crazy yeah. shit? Because if that's the case, your name should be crazy motherfucker, not gnarly. My boy it's Dave, a difference. says safety first, but I say safety last. And anything that you liked or enjoyed? Or that you've been waiting for like the last five years to find? The affinity frames. It's like, what, 375 now? So... That's a good deal. Nah, it's 375 here. It's not 375 oh, now, no, but I feel I you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but um, did, 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 is, is there one that you have your eye on? Yeah, it's that uh, that gray one back there with the blue, um, uh, what is it? The blue decals on it. Oh, the blue decals on it. Is it the casino? No, nah, it's a low pro. Oh, it's a low pro. Okay. Are you planning to lean with that tonight? Maybe. It's either that or some Thompson parts. Okay. <laughs> as long as the price is right. Yeah, hell yeah. yeah. <laughs> so it's about, oh, you want to do the black, the price is right? Oh, <laughs> do rag behind door number one. How much do you think it is? Even though you don't wear silkies. Oh, he said you don't got a hairline. But Shut up. <laughs> Five dollars. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, bro. Yeah. No <laughs> I, dude, I used to be a size nine, and I used to wear a thirteen. Oh, you put your foot in a bigger shoe? Yes, that because I'm like. Have of room to stretch out. Mine the opposite. It was like my mom was like, "Do those fit?" I'm like, "Yes, yes, <laughs> yes, yes." yes. yes.